What was that? Those aren't real soldiers, are they? Soldiers wouldn't do that. Why did they capture Reagan? And why did they try to kill her? I don't get it at all. I have to help her. They'll kill her if I leave her be. I can't go out there, though. Can I? Oh, I better save. Nope. Um... Oh boy, oh boy. I bet I'd die if I... Let's test it. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. That's no fun. Um, good thing I saved. You notice that 2.37 timer on the game. That's just because I left it running open, stupidly. <laughs> Honestly, I haven't been trolling around that long. Trust me. Nathan! Sophie! Why are you here? Quiet, they'll notice us. I'll untie the ropes. Gah, they're way too tight. Hold on, I'll find something to cut these. Where am I supposed to... In here? Ah, cool. Stationary. Sweet. Don't worry, Reagan. Reagan, I brought cutters. I'll cut the ropes now. Quickly, hurry up! Damn it, what's with those guys? I've been saying they're going to kill a girl. What did I ever do, huh? Reagan, why are you here so late at night? Oh, how should I know? I was asleep in my room, then I woke up here. They must have kidnapped me. They came right into Mama's mall. I have them sued. I, th I think that can wait for later. Reagan, things are weird in town. Everyone's asleep when there's there was these shadows. At any rate, let's get out of here. There's a friend of mine outside. Oh, escape? That's never going to happen. They're patrolling. They'll find us if we move. Well, well then what, Reagan? They're going to notice you got away. If you sit still, they're going to find you. Shut up! Don't order me around, Sophie! Why don't you try and escape? I'll wait for Mama to come help. Reagan. You're going to die. Why are you crying, Reagan? Papa and Mama are fighting again. Papa was yelling and Mama was crying. I'm too scared to go back home. Hey, Reagan. My Mama's dead, you know. Oh, why'd she die? She was so shot by Ban Kroeber or something. So I don't have a Mum. It's just me and Papa. But I don't cry. I have to keep going even without a Mum. If I cry, Papa would worry, right? So you shouldn't cry, Reagan. If you cry, you're a crybaby. Do you want to be a crybaby, Reagan? No, I don't want to be a crybaby. Then play with me. Your mum and dad should get along so again soon. We can play until then. Okay. I uh, used to be friends. Crybaby. Ah! I said you're a crybaby. You act so high and mighty bullying people, but you can't do a thing by yourself. Say that again, why don't you? Cry, baby. I'll say it again and again. You haven't changed one bit since Kid in our garden. You're useless without your mummy to help. Even your bullying. You just use me to take out your stress when things don't go well at home. Shut up! You stay that I like I need you. First of all, you and me, completely different. You're just jealous. No, mum. And your dad abandons you. You're jealous because nobody will save you. That's not... My papa may be trash, but my mama loves me. She's concerned for me even now. I'm sure she'll come to look for me soon. And nobody will come look for you, so don't lump yourself with me. So horrible. Oh, look, I'm so... So what? You're just going to sit here for your mum until those soldiers come kill you. Sorry. 
but that's not my idea of a plan. I'm going to stay out of their sight and run. <laughs> what about you? Fine, I'll come with. But how do you expect to escape? I don't know. But it's dark, and I'm sure there's a way to avoid being seen. We'll do something! Hey boy. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, let me save. <laughs> oh my god. That's pro. That's so fucking pro. Oh boy. <laughs> so the fuck? That was unlucky. Come on. Come on. Cobble box. Hold shift to squat. Okay. That would have been helpful. Wait, let's do this. I'm gonna become monster assassin criminal people. I mean, escape artists, that's the word. Ah! <laughs> oh, <laughs> I like how I can shift with the box. This is scary. Nibby suspicious of suddenly seeing a box there. There are so many soldiers! Oh, what's the plan now? We're not gonna make it outside like this! Ugh, be quiet. Maybe I can strike them somehow. <laughs> if I go in down any further, they'll see me. Oh my god. What do I do? What do I do? Uh, can I throw the box? No. What items do I have? Oh, the doll! <laughs> Alright, Regan, quick, let's dash outside! <laughs> oh! Uh oh. Get up, Regan, run! Oh god, we did it! We escaped! They're watching us! Reagan, run! We've got to go further! Oh, we did it, Reagan! We made it out! Reagan? Reagan, where'd you go? Don't tell me she fell behind! I know I was running for my life, but... I thought we were together! No, no, what? I have to find her. But David might be waiting. Okay, I'll have David help. I'm sure the two of us can find her. Gotta get to the park. David! David, you have to help! What's the hurry? Regan, an old friend of mine, she she might be killed by some soldiers. Please help me look for Regan. She might be killed if we don't find her. And, and Han too. What if? Sophie, calm down. What in the world happened? At the mall, there were these soldiers. I, I tried to help Regan. We got away, but Regan... 
Sophie, what's wrong? I don't know. I just feel tired all of a sudden. Sophie, take a break. You're pushing yourself too much. It's okay, I'll listen, but first you need to calm down. Suspicious soldiers? What could that be about? Is the army getting involved in this? I don't think they're real soldiers. I mean, it's too weird. Why send a high school girl to a firing squad? Yeah, I really at a loss here. But I'm sure your friend is fine. I haven't seen any shadows or soldiers like you saw. Maybe they just can't go outside. You made it out with her, right? So she should be fine. Don't worry about- don't worry yourself sick. At any rate, take a break. You shouldn't push it. Which is what I always say. <laughs> Sorry for worrying you, David. <laughs> Who cares about me? I'll just be happy if you don't do anything rash. Hey, Sophie. I really am worried for you, you know. You always seem pained ever since we met. More flashbacks. Sophie, let's go have lunch. Yeah, give me a sec. Huh? What's wrong? I thought I had five bucks in my wallet. Did I drop it somewhere? Hey, girls, look, I just ran a fiver. Oh, really? Talk about lucky, Reagan. Guess I am. I swear some doofus dropped it. I'm going to splurge on dessert today. Uh, Sophie? I've got some allowance money. I can pay for your lunch today. I it's fine. I don't want lunch. I think I lost my appetite. Oh man, I'm hungry. Knew I should have had Anne get me lunch. Maybe I have enough for ice cream. Mm, this new ice cream is great. Maybe this was a stroke of luck after all. Ah! Whoa, sorry, I wasn't looking. Are you okay? Are you hurt? Oh, your ice cream. I'm sorry, I'll pay for it. Did you get it on your uniform? Are you okay? It's, it's fine. And it's just an ice cream. Sorry for bumping into you. Um, but... Um, do you mind me asking? I think it's going okay for you. You look kind of pale. I'm just tired and I'm always pale. I'm really fine, so please don't worry. You don't need to pay for the ice cream either. Oh, look. The cake here is really good. I love sweet stuff myself. I come here all the time to unwind after work. I'm really sorry about earlier. I hope you can forgive me. Thank you very much. He's right, this chocolate cake is great. I feel like it's been so long since I ate sweets with someone. So depressing. <laughs> Sophie, what's wrong? Bullied? Well, I'd say that happened to me too, but... Flight school's different from girls to Catholic school. Bullies just can't face up to themselves, you know? Can't solve their own problems, they attack others. Sucks having to be the victim, of course. Yeah, you might be right. Maybe the girl who's bullying me can't face up to herself. I knew her as a kid, and I know there's family trouble. But I remember how we used to play together, so I can't bring herself, myself to tell her to stop. I feel like I should just put up with it. There's no need to torture yourself like that. Maybe you should just be honest about it. Ah, oh, sorry. I, I know I'm a total stranger, so it's none of my business. Don't say that. I feel better just having someone listen. Thank you so much. The cake was delicious, and I'm glad you listened to me too. I don't have anyone else to talk to. Well, goodbye. Sophie. I, uh, I live nearby, actually. If we meet again, would you talk to me? I can at least listen if you want me to. Is that okay? Yeah, of course. If you're trouble, come to this restaurant. We'll s if we see each other, we'll talk. Oh. 
Every time we've met, you still seem troubled, especially these days. I can't help but worry. No, nothing's really changed since we met. It's just one bad thing after another, and I'm sleepless and irritated as ever. Enough of this, okay, David? Enough about me. I, c I can put up with it. Lots of people have to suffer. I don't want to be the only one who whines and cries about it. And I can forget about the bad things with time. This situation is more important. We haven't seen a, a single other person awake and have no clue what could be going on. Hey, Sophie. Have you seen your father? Hey? Your father stays at work a lot, right? So I was wondering if you saw him. Was he at home? No, he wasn't. He left a note saying he'd be at work, so I'm sure he'd be there. I say we go look for him. You're worried about him, right? But I'm worried about Reagan and Anne, too. Well, I can look for those two. Your father works at J.P. Gordon and Chase, right? I'll head there, too, if I find them. And if you finish first, come to the fountain park, okay? Thanks, David. I'll do that. Uh, David! Hmm? What? Is there anyone else you want to look for, David? Anyone really important you want to see? I don't know. I'm just happy if you're safe. Huh? Well, I'll see you later. Be careful. Oh! Oh! Oh, you know! He's so cute! Oh. This is a little bit of hope in this world. With that, though, I'm going to end this episode. Oh. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. That would certainly mean the world to me and make me motivate me to make more of these videos. And as always, thanks for watching. Hopefully see you next time. Bye-bye.